What's up, everyone? Tomcat back here again, and we're talking about sight unseen. So, yeah. Not many of my subscribers have met me face-to-face. -face. There's a lot of people on the offline life that haven't met me face-to-face, -face, and vice versa. So, we're talking about sight unseen. You, know, you never really know somebody until you spend time with them in person. But even that could be detrimental to a degree. Let me break down a story for you. A couple years ago, I tried starting a mag. And I picked people that I've known for decades. And I was reaching out to new people. Well, the people I've known for decades, a lot of them swore that to my face they were down and they could handle their ends. But behind the scenes, behind my back, they were doing and saying something a whole lot different. <clears throat> So even when you spend time with people, there's some parts from yesterday, even when you spend time with people, you don't really know them, but sight unseen also. You always got to be careful with who you're working with, because just because you think you know somebody, people could say, oh, I watch Tomcat every day on YouTube, and he's an honest dude, and he comes out raw and real. He knows his stuff, but they ain't never spent time with me. So how do they know? I could be anybody online just like you guys could be anybody online. So it's sight unseen. Beware. Because you never know. But I always say the best way to get to know somebody is spend time with them face to face. Now I love all of you. That's definite. And I wouldn't trade any of you for a million bucks, but I don't know you guys. Not like that. And you don't know me like that. So we're basically going sight unseen. You're always going to have a straggler, whether it's online or offline life. You're always going to have someone that says they're down just to try to burn it down. You know what I'm saying? That's why I always say, take everything with a grain of salt, man. Now, I'm not saying any of you. I'm saying as a general rule of thumb of life, that's sight unseen. You never know who you're talking to. You never know what someone's going through. Why do we say any group or community as strong as the weakest link? Because you know what? Someone could tell you everything you want to see, everything you want to hear. Everything can be copacetic. Then when a bad situation happens or whatever situation happens, and you find yourselves together, you're ready to go. You've got everything. All your ducks are in a row. They don't. So now you have to be prepared to take your plan, your backup plan, and turn it on its face so you can help someone else. Now all your plans are ruined. Because everything that you strive to do, sight unseen, the other person didn't do it. So these are things you've got to think about also. Sight unseen. Any sight. Situational. Personal. Business. Whatever have you, pick your poison. It all goes down the same from the same cup. So always be careful on sight unseen. You don't really know somebody till you know somebody. And even then, you don't know somebody. To reiterate what I just said, these are people I've known for decades. And I thought I knew them. But you know what? You get to know somebody by when they betray you. You get to know somebody... When they don't keep up their appearance logistically and honestly. This is why I always say raw, real, humble, and honest. Because what you see and hear from me is what you get from me. Even sight unseen. Doesn't matter. And that's the way to live. Because when people can trust you and your word means something. And you can walk it like you talk it and show it like you know it. Then you get trust. Then you get respect. Then people start to see who you really are as a person. So I love you guys. Stay strong. Stay safe. Stay positive. Come up with a plan. Make it a damn good plan. Have a damn good backup plan. Have a damn good safety net plan. Have a damn good plan of any kind. And always watch your 6 and your 12. Because ain't no one else going to do it. And then you got to watch out who's doing it for you. You might have someone that claims they'll get your 6 and your 12. But they got your 2 and they got your 10. So I love you guys. And we'll see you later for more, baby. Tom got out.